think <laughs> I know why I'm addicted to adrenaline. Adrenaline. Because, um, like, with depression, you kind of, like, can get really overwhelmed and think that something's not fixable and that it's pointless to try and all that stuff. Um, and you have to constantly remind yourself that things can get better and and remind yourself how good it feels when it does get better. Um, and not, sometimes, like, whatever that was really wasn't even that hard to make better. Uh, and I was thinking of that because I was working on my basketball wheelchair I'm like, switching all the straps over and for some reason it's, like, too tight now on my hips. Um, and it's, it's complicated and there's a lot of reasons that it's too tight because I switched the whole thing from one chair to the other, like the straps and the side guards and stuff. Um, and so anyway, I just kind of felt like my wheelchair is shitty and um, I need a new one or like it's just going to be slow and I'm not going to, I don't know, I just kind of like try to convince myself that it's, it's I can't make it better and it's so overwhelming but I just spent forever like working on it and it took a good amount of time but now it's like cleaned up and things fit good and um there's like other adjustments I need to make you know to make the straps tighter um I need to I need to like go buy something or do some cutting or whatever but I know that I can all I just have to do it like I can make the straps tighter and so that is what made me realize that that's something I have to do all the time is I think things are impossible or just really unlikely to happen for me um, and I'm really unlikely to be able to to do it to learn it or to and because I have to constantly push through that and do it anyway and then show myself like see this was possible and it's like so exciting when I see it um, it makes it feel like that much more amazing because it felt so hard before and that I just realized is me all the time with like almost everything and that makes sense yeah it's crazy it is a trip life is a trip hopefully I figure it out get my shit together you know I'm 29 <laughs> it's crazy okay I'm gonna go now Finish my chair and take a shower.